Siem Reap, Cambodia, a place where time seems to stand still. It's a land of vibrant green rice paddies and ancient temples. Here, the magnificent ruins of Angkor, a UNESCO World Heritage Site, whisper tales of a glorious past. Among these architectural marvels stands the Elephant Terrace, a testament to the grandeur of the Khmer Empire. Imagine stepping back in time. You're surrounded by the remnants of a civilization that thrived centuries ago. The Elephant Terrace, with its intricate carvings and imposing structure, offers a glimpse into the heart of this lost world. It's a truly awe-inspiring sight. As you wander through the complex, you can almost hear the echoes of elephants trumpeting and crowds cheering. This was a place of royal processions and grand ceremonies. The Elephant Terrace, a stage for the Khmer kings to display their power and prestige. Let's delve deeper into its fascinating history. The Elephant Terrace is a testament to one man's vision, King Jayavarmanevan. He ruled the Khmer Empire from 1181 to 1218 AD. This great king is considered one of the most prolific builders of Angkor. His reign marked a golden age for the empire. King Jayavarman VII was a devout Buddhist. He dedicated his life to expanding the empire and solidifying his Buddhist legacy. He commissioned numerous temples, monasteries and hospitals throughout his reign. The Elephant Terrace, a testament to his ambition and devotion, served as a grand platform for royal audiences and ceremonies. The king's image is said to be represented in many of the terrace's carvings. Some believe that the five-headed horses depict the king himself, while others see him in the serene faces of the bodhisattvas. The Elephant Terrace, a symbol of the king's power and piety, stands as a testament to his enduring legacy. The Elephant Terrace is a sight to behold. It stretches over 300 meters, almost 1,000 feet in length. Imagine a football field and then picture something even longer. It forms part of the eastern wall of the Royal Square in Angkor Thom. This massive structure was not just built for show, it served a practical purpose. The terrace, built on a raised platform, provided a vantage point for the king and his entourage to observe parades and ceremonies held in the Royal Square. Constructed from layers of laterite and sandstone, the terrace is adorned with intricate carvings that have withstood the test of time. The terrace's most striking feature is undoubtedly its elephants. These majestic creatures are carved in high relief, their trunks reaching out as if to greet the visitor. Each elephant is unique, showcasing the skill and artistry of the Khmer sculptors. This magnificent structure is a testament to the architectural genius of the Khmer Empire. The Elephant Terrace is not just adorned with elephants. Look closer and you'll discover a menagerie of mythical beasts and divine creatures. These carvings are not mere decorations, they hold deep symbolic meaning. Among the most impressive are the five-headed horses, or Balaha. These mythical creatures, believed to be the mounts of gods, symbolize strength, power and victory. They stand guard at the southern end of the terrace, their heads held high as if ready to take flight. You'll also encounter Garudas, mythical birdmen, their wings outstretched in a protective gesture. These creatures, often depicted battling serpents, represent the struggle between good and evil. Lions, symbols of royalty and courage, guard the staircases, while Naga balustrades adorned with multi-headed serpents add to the mystical aura of the terrace. Each carving tells a story, each creature plays a role in the rich tapestry of Hindu and Buddhist mythology. Section 5, the Elephant Procession, a spectacle of royal power. Imagine the scene, hundreds of years ago, the Elephant Terrace teeming with life. The king, adorned in jewels and silks, would appear at the top of the terrace. He'd be accompanied by his entourage of officials, priests and soldiers. The crowd would erupt in cheers, their eyes drawn to the magnificent spectacle unfolding before them. The Elephant Terrace was not just a static monument, it was a stage for elaborate ceremonies and processions. The most impressive of these was undoubtedly the Elephant Procession. Elephants adorned with ceremonial robes and jewels would parade along the terrace. These processions served a dual purpose. They showcased the king's power and wealth. They also honored the elephants, revered as sacred animals in Khmer culture. The Elephant Terrace, once a stage for such grand displays, still evokes a sense of awe and wonder. Section 6, Echoes of the Past, the Terrace's Religious Significance. The Elephant Terrace, though grand, was more than just a stage for royal display. It held deep religious significance. The Khmer Empire, during Jayavarman VII's reign, was deeply influenced by Mahayana Buddhism. This influence is evident in the Terrace's design and carvings. The elephants themselves were considered sacred animals in Buddhism. They represent strength, wisdom and good fortune. The presence of Garudas and Nagas also points to the influence of Hindu mythology, which coexisted with Buddhism in the Khmer Empire. 
These mythical creatures, revered in both religions, highlight the syncretic nature of Khmer beliefs. The elephant terrace, built as a tribute to the king's power, also served as a reminder of the divine forces that governed the universe. It was a place where the earthly and the spiritual realms intertwined. Preserving Angkor's heritage, a shared responsibility. The Elephant Terrace, like other temples in Angkor, has faced its share of challenges. Centuries of exposure to the elements, along with looting and war, have taken their toll. However, efforts are underway to preserve this magnificent structure for future generations. Organizations like UNESCO and the Apsara National Authority are working tirelessly to restore and protect Angkor's temples. Their efforts include conservation work, archaeological research and community engagement. Tourism plays a vital role in these preservation efforts. The revenue generated from entrance fees directly funds the conservation and management of the Angkor site. As visitors, we have a responsibility to tread lightly and respect these ancient ruins. We must ensure that future generations can continue to marvel at the wonders of Angkor. Practical tips for exploring the Elephant Terrace. Ready to experience the magic of the Elephant Terrace for yourself? Here are a few practical tips to make your visit memorable. Timing is key. The best time to visit the Elephant Terrace is early morning or late afternoon. The light is softer and the crowds are thinner. You'll be able to fully appreciate the intricate carvings and the serene atmosphere. Dress respectfully. Remember that Angkor Wat is a sacred site. Dress modestly, covering your shoulders and knees. Comfortable shoes are a must as you'll be doing a fair bit of walking. Hire a guide. Consider hiring a local guide. They can provide valuable insights into the history, mythology and significance of the Elephant Terrace. They can also help you navigate the complex and avoid the crowds. Stay hydrated, carry plenty of water with you, as it can get quite hot and humid in Angkor. Beyond the Terrace, further adventures in Angkor. The Elephant Terrace is just one of many architectural wonders waiting to be discovered in Angkor. The nearby Bayon Temple, with its enigmatic smiling faces, is a must-see. Don't miss Ta Proem, the Tomb Raider Temple, where nature has reclaimed the ruins in a breathtaking display. For a truly immersive experience, consider taking a hot air balloon ride over Angkor Wat at sunrise. The view from above is simply breathtaking. You'll get a whole new perspective on the scale and grandeur of this ancient city. Siem Reap itself is a charming town with plenty to offer. Explore the bustling markets, indulge in a traditional Khmer massage, or sample the local cuisine. The Elephant Terrace, a testament to the ingenuity and artistry of the Khmer Empire, offers a glimpse into a bygone era. It's a place where history comes alive. The intricate carvings whisper tales of kings and gods, of processions and ceremonies. As you stand before this magnificent structure, let your imagination soar. Picture the elephants parading, the crowds cheering, and the king surveying his domain. The Elephant Terrace is more than just a pile of stones, it's a portal to the past. So come, explore the wonders of Angkor, Discover the magic of the Elephant Terrace and let its beauty and